but the blood of Jesus. That's the right thing. But God said, Come on, come on. Tell somebody that I am praying. Even though I'm not answering yet in our prayer, but I'm still praying.
God put you up. Remember you will put you up. You may be criticism and all that day, but when God put you up, Reggie, just do the work of God. We are going to put you. Please work in where we put you. You know, he's saying he's some teaching, some preaching, some evangelist, some whatever. You know, some preaching. If I sing of this thing, sing. No matter what he may act. No. You know, if I talk and evangelize to somebody, just do it. Say, no, this morning, you know, we're not going to have to understand we're going to call it and praise and worship. No. And you know, bring the take part of the singing. It is singing. Sing until the power of God comes down. Shall magnify the Lord. Hallelujah. You know, it's true that this is the day this morning. And you know, we are called. That it's an honor to give God the third in God, you know, whatever has to be here this morning. So I'm glad that, you know, we are we can be here together to give God the praise. And I say the Bible, we're one and two again, and I serving Him. He is in the midst. So this morning, we're to raise our voices again and give God every single thing that He deserves. We just take our way to we just take our way our problems that we're going through, all we can and just go to Him and give God everything that He deserves. I worship the Lord.
any hypocrisy. That's all we need to be praying. We're asking God to set us on fire. We're asking God to come and fill us, fill our lives with the anointing. That's all we're asking God is praying. Shall we be praying?
I found a new life. 11 years ago, going to 12 years, I found a new life. And if anybody asks me, I am the success sister. They sanctified. Holy Ghost filled. Water baptized. Jesus had my mind. Jesus had my mind. I found a new life. What case did I say to him in this morning? Hallelujah! 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 I found a new life. Thanks be to God. This life is forever. Not for only a part time. It's forever. I am happy, happy in Jesus. I was not in all there until Jesus for me. I am safe. I am happy in Jesus. I am light like a car preaching. But I didn't see come that day. I can wait. I wake up on the bridge, mug of slugs, everything. Look, up, look at me now. Because I found a new life. And life is Jesus. He said, Come to give life and give it more abundantly. While the enemy comes to steal and destroy. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Okay, we're going to go into our next year. We're going to tell, we're going to ask you to give the praise and worship team a hand of applause. Clap them, man. Continue, my people. Continue, your people. Continue to sing for the Lord. We see where the enemy trying to come in and try to snap out. But in the name of Jesus, they shall stand. They shall stand and never remove. Amen, amen. We're going into our next segment. We're going into the testimony segment this morning. You know, there's so much in the Lord has done for your brother. Nobody can see cancer in our testimony. Because right now, I'm not bashing up blind man. No blind man, not here, blind woman. No dumb is not here this morning. Everyone can hear this morning. Say amen. You can hear? Amen. 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 We're going to call it for Sister Akela. Big Grove to give her testimony. Sister Akela, Big Grove. Big. Blake. Sister Akela, Big Grove. Come on, my sister. Come on, man. If you reach up here, baby. And followed by Sister Big Grove, Sister Camille. Good morning, church. You know, you know, oh, like I just baptized. I'm like, okay, living my daily life. Do you know, oh, so like, I always start reading my Bible. Every single time I'll be like, okay, I'm going to read it today. I'm going to read it the, tomorrow. But I know you can touch the Bible. So, like, I keep on procrastinating. And then this one time, I got a dream, and then, like, I could have seen, but like, my mind was telling me that I was blind. So basically, he's saying that I'm spiritually blind. So I was like, okay then, since my mind is not only to start work on myself, because my mind is not all going to myself neither, and nobody can tell me that there's something wrong with me. So, I start to wake up early in the morning, I'm praying, things, um, I have tried something, so I'm trying to ask you guys to pray for me while I pray for myself, and that's the end of my Yes, 
But if you pass the test, you normally don't have to resit it. So why do the same thing over and over? So take a start, you know, Rev said to me one day, Shabel, you check up on Shana K. And then somebody else said to me, say, you check up on Shana K. And then you say, oh, nobody say, you check up on yourself. They're going, come to me. You know what? May I say, you let you have strength for here right now. Oh, you can check up on her. What may I just say? So, I'm going to know the first word go pray and tell them, say, all right, God, and just let your will be done. Thank you. 